Hi guys, my name is Anastasia and today I want to share with you the story on how I created the logo for my brand using Fiverr. It's not an ad, it's my story, my personal experience, the story of me creating my own brand. Own brand. And in this video, we'll just go directly into my Fiverr account. I will share with you some cool features that I really liked on Fiverr. Uh, we will go through the whole communication with the designer team of mine and I will answer all of the hot questions like how much did it cost to create the logo? Uh, how, uh, how much time did it take to, uh, to create the logo? Was I satisfied with the end result or not? We'll see everything in this video. One cool thing is that I have recorded the video and I'll link it here on um, analyzing different choices of the designers and designer teams. I analyzed, actually was thinking about going with the marketing agency instead of the freelancer and especially instead of Fiverr, which was like something new for me. So in that video, I will share with you all of my thoughts, why I actually picked Fiverr at the end of the day. So if you're interested, if you are in the same stage as I was back then, then I highly recommend this video for you. And of course, let me know in the comments below if this is something that you are interested in or not, so that I know if I need to let uh, to provide you with more content like this. Okay, let's go to my Fiverr account. We're right now on my Fiverr page, and um, well, over here we have the uh, the search, and we'll just use it. So I'll just go with searching for logo designs, which is quite um, quite easy to do. And now what I like here is that, as you can see, we have lots of different filters on Fiverr. First of all, I can actually filter by style of the logo that I am looking for. So um, because there are lots of different freelancers uh, working on this platform, it will be really, it will take me a lot of time to go through all of them and study all of them. So I'll just pick whether I want my logo to be minimalist, 3D, mascot, signature, etc., etc. So it's the general feeling of the logo. So for example, let's go with minimalistic logo. It will automatically filter the results for me. Now, I can also uh, filter uh, by some uh, details about the seller. So for example, if I want to, um, to have top rated seller with mm, like um, the most reliable ones, or for example, I want the seller to speak specific languages that I do, or anything else to be from the same country as I am. So I can filter by uh, the seller details, but I can also filter by budget. And for me at that point, well, I was just creating the MVP of my mobile app. So budget was quite important for me. And uh, that's why it was really useful that I could just filter and don't see, you know, beautiful projects, that, but the ones that I could, couldn't afford at that time. So filter by budget, really, uh, really cool. And also the one that I love, is the delivery time. So I can filter for projects that can be delivered at any time. So I'm not like pressured to its timing. It's okay, I can wait um, if for, for the designer of my, of my choice. But I can also filter, for example, for up to seven days delivery, up to three days, and also express 24 hour delivery. Of course, to, like express delivery will cost you something extra, but there is a cho there is a choice like that. And in my case, if you uh, if you watched that that previous video of mine, I told you that it was super important for me to get this done as soon as possible. So the idea that I could actually choose the timing when I wanted to receive the first initial concept of the designs was crucial for me. And this is the feature that I loved. And for me, it's just the deal breaker comparing to other, other websites. So yeah, for example, we are going to choose up to three days and we're going to just click apply. And now you will have all of the results filtered accordingly. You can use different, like more filters. You can also filter the sellers that are online right now so that you can chat with them and receive instant responses. So lots of different filters you can go through. Now, when you're going to choose whatever, I'm just going to a random, uh, random page. 
and over here you will see that you will receive information about uh, about the designer you will be able to preview their work you will be able to see the reviews go to all the reviews and what is super important is that you need to read uh, information about the gig as you can see here because in this specific field they let you know what is going to be the end result and seriously please pay attention on this section because they described here what will you receive how they're going to work how they're going to do that what are their expectations because they might expect you for example to deliver uh, some benchmarks some ideas that you like or don't like any other details for your project and for example they let you know that if you don't deliver this they're not going to start working on your project lots of stuff can be can be placed here so make sure to read all of this some designers uh, will let you know that they will ask you to contact them first before placing an order because for example they are working on different platforms and sometimes their timeline is not synchronized so to make sure they will ask you to to message them different different things as i mentioned so make sure to read uh, to read this geek information now on the right side here you can see information about the packages that are available and usually they have three packages basic standard and premium and also take a look at what exactly is included in each uh, each package so they are going to be different in terms of uh, the pricing of course but also uh, quite often it's um, it's different based on the delivery date so for example here we have two uh, days uh, delivery and for premium it's one day delivery so you will receive it almost instantly and also the number of revisions so after you receive the initial concept how many revisions you can do for free well, included in this price and then for example if you have two it means that if you need to uh, to do the third revision you will have to pay extra for it so yeah and then if you uh, if we click on what's included you will see uh, information what exactly will be included please pay attention to this as well because as you can see here for example here you will not receive the source file so if you want to receive the logo and then be able to edit it on your own to improve it later on on your own to use it in different other projects whatever you just want to have the source files to be the actual owner of the file for example here in basic version it's not included but I believe yeah in premium it's of course of course included so pay attention at this as well and I like this a lot because this this gives you this bullet point list it's easy to read you can read it really fast you know just scan and look for the for the team that you are that you like and you have at least in my case I had like this gave me the feeling that okay I could trust this like you know if I will not receive this I don't know four initial concepts at the very beginning well I will just ask for the refund and move on with another freelancer so it gave me um, I don't know I like this feature <laughs> let's 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 move on so um, so this was really cool for me okay now let's go and see my order just click on orders and as you can see I have the order completed now let's go to the details first and let's see how much uh, how much does it cost me to create the logo well I wanted to create the logo fast and cheap as well because it's like an MVP stage of the project I just wanted to test an idea so I didn't want to spend the fortune on it and as you can see here I paid um, I paid this amount of money for as a total price for my logo which I think is super cheap for the uh, for the logo I received which is like super professional one so it was an amazing price for me now um, what was included I received the source file so first one I had an unlimited revision in this price which was just wow mind-blowing I had lots of different I have lots of revisions to be honest so it was cool that I had unlimited uh, amount to make sure that I actually like the concept the final concept I had three concepts included 3d mockups printable files logo transparency and vector files so everything I needed 
pay attention on that. Well, generally, I uh, like the um, the price was seventy five dollars, but you will also be charged with the fees. So, as you can see, um, uh, as well as I paid extra for social media kit, thirty dollars, and as you can see here, uh, this is the total amount after uh, after the uh, adding of social media and uh, kit and the, the services fee. Uh, later on, I actually created, uh, actually asked the team to create the additional logo concept, which was not included because I had only um, three uh, three logo designs. And I asked during the whole work corporation, I asked for initial concept, additional concept. So it costs me extra twenty five dollars. But overall, it's still really cheap for the logo. Okay, now let's uh, take a look at the requirements. What was what I really liked about the team I worked with is that at the very beginning of our cooperation, they sent me the predefined like template with the questions about my project. So as you can see here, let us know your company name. So Goldspar, what is your tagline motto? I just let them know that it's not included in the logo itself. Now, share the brief description, guide us with your target audience, etc, etc. So, uh, they asked me different questions that helped them to understand my brand. And during the whole cooperation, they were asking more and more questions to let me know a little bit better. So, we were just uh, taking uh, a lot of the discussions on this and it was really cool that it's all included here to make sure they can always come back and see the initial requirements. Now, let's say, uh, let's take a look at the activity. As you can see, I placed an order on 18th of August. Now, let's, um, let's see. First of all, once after placing an order, I had to fulfill the brief and it took me like one day, let's say to uh, to deliver this uh, this brief for them. Okay, here you have it. And so 18th and then I uh, fulfilled the brief and then 19th of August they messaged me back with the information that I now have my project manager. That was super professional if you ask me. Well, I wasn't expect, I didn't expect to receive the whole team working on my brand, on my logo, but it turned out that I received the project manager who was responsible for the cooperation with me and the designers on their on their site. And this project manager was like the most important person for me because I needed them to understand, uh, to understand the concept. And it was really cool because uh, this, uh, this project manager was really nice. And he was asking lots of questions about, about my project first. So as you can see here, uh, they, before starting working on the first concept, they actually wanted to know me better. So we were just casually like talking about the, the project. And then as you can see on 20th of August, they delivered my first, uh, my first order. So it's the first delivery. And as you can see, there are zips with uh, all these files. All the source files are also attached. So I received the whole kit that I was asking for. And as you can see here, are the, um, are the files to preview the designs. Okay, so I got first concepts in two days, which were in, was amazing. Later on, I asked them for the, uh, for the revision. And generally I send them my feedback. I, um, uh, created the PDF with my review and all of the remarks for the team and then they started working on uh, on changes well what is important here the whole process took us around a month even though the first concepts were delivered in two days the whole process took us around four weeks why is that well first of all they created lots of different concepts for me, even more than I actually could expect. Um, because, well, it was a really tough task 
if you ask me. It's supposed to be the logo for the brand, but it also um, supposed to be done the way that I can reuse it as an icon for the mobile app. So they have um, they have such uh, quite uh, quite hard task to to do. Uh, yeah, so task for, for time to to create all of the concepts, then time to uh, to to me actually for to analyze what I received to give them feedback. I also had like to sit down, carefully analyze everything, write down all of my remarks. So it also took time. And then even uh, when we've already decided, okay, so let's go with this and this logo, still uh, we had to work on the app icon later on. So it also took us time uh, to work on the icon, which is why I think that four weeks to create the logo from scratch and uh, to deliver uh, the app icon that I wanted and actually in three colors I will uh, I will show you later on I think it's amazing especially if we're taking into account the price that I paid and during the whole process you can see well you can see here during the whole process they were super nice uh, they wanted to make sure that I know that I have unlimited revisions and they will do everything to make sure that I am satisfied with the final result. So at the end of the day, I was like, it was amazing and I was glad I picked them and I actually ended up leaving the, uh, I don't know if it's going to be seen here, but I ended up uh, giving them, yeah, giving them the five star review because everything was excellent if you ask uh, if you ask me okay so now you know uh, how much money it took you know uh, that it took us as you see it's 23rd of september when uh, yeah when i well 20th of september when they delivered the um the f the last uh, the last files that i accepted a few days later um, what else can I tell you? Well, I can show you my logo. So here you can see the logo of mine. And as I mentioned, it's in three colors. So they delivered the blue version, they delivered the black version, and they delivered the white version to make sure that I can reuse it, you know, in different situations on different backgrounds. That was amazing. Here is an app icon. Also amazing if you ask me. So for all of those files, Plus, I get the source files, I got, I got the vector files, I got the PDF files, everything I needed. And everything deli delivered in such short term. I'm quite impressed and I'm happy that I actually picked Fiber. If there is anything I can, I can just help you with, let me know in the comment section. I will answer to all of you guys, I promise. And if you like this video, please let me know by giving me a like button so that I know that I'm doing something right and that I need uh, to, to record more videos like that. Thank you so much in advance and hope to see you in my next videos.